Anyway. Oh, oh. Why did I do that? Hey guys, welcome back to Bella Boo's Lunches, or if you're new, welcome. Today I have a grocery haul. I have Aldi here and hy over there. So I'm just going to go through this stuff first and kind of show you what we picked up. We have some really yummy uh, recipes that we're going to be trying out this week. And yeah, so I got kind of a variety and a bunch of stuff. Uh, we got some little flour tortillas. And then we get these deli rolls. And I did check this time. I think they're sliced. I think they're sliced this way. I bought them before where they were sliced this way. And that kind of drove us crazy. But I think these ones are sliced the correct way. So I got those for her lunch just for sandwiches. Some more of these little chewy granola bars. Some kettle chips over here. You can see them or not. We love these chips. They're like so hard. Some baby spinach and arugula, which worked out perfect because I needed both baby spinach and arugula. So we may just have to kind of it looks like most of the spinach is over there and most of the arugula is over there, but it may have gotten mixed a little bit. But yeah, so we needed both. That's for two different recipes. And then we needed a couple Roma tomatoes. So I picked up two of those. Some eggs, hard-boiled eggs, whatever eggs. Avocados. We want to make some green beans and add these to them. These are just uh, slivered almonds. I thought it would sound really good with the green beans. I don't know. Uh, some butter, heavy whipping cream in the back, and then some cornstarch there as well. That's all for recipes. We're going to, I'm going to Costco tomorrow to pick up a veggie tray because we want to do a broil. And I've kind of been craving Brussels sprouts. Is that weird? So I picked up some Brussels sprouts that I can put on the broil. This is all Aldi so far. I haven't switched over to the Hy-Vee side. Uh, some naan to make some flatbread pizzas. Some mushrooms, just because, I don't know, I've really been digging mushrooms lately. And then turkey for sandwiches. And I finally found honey yogurt. I've been looking for this, right? I, never, I haven't found it yet. I think this is the first time me finding it. But somebody had recommended a long time ago to get the honey Greek yogurt, and it was so good. So I saw it, so we bought it. Uh, and then I picked up the sausage because we're making, it's like a sausage stew. I think I've made it before, maybe like in a recipe. I don't remember. But anyway, I'm making it again. Um, and then I got this quartet of hummus. So it has classic roasted red bell pepper, garlic, and cilantro jalapeno. So I don't know like the order that they're in, but it's definitely not the order that this thing is in. I think this goes like this. That looks more right. There you go. Anyway, does it matter? No, it doesn't matter. That's all that I got at Aldi. So let me move my high V stuff over to show you that. All right, and here is my high V stuff. I didn't get quite as much as the, at high V, but believe it or not, I spent about the same. Uh, so I'm starting here. I got this Chipotle marinade mix. I couldn't find Chipotle seasoning. So I'm hoping that this will work. I have two recipes that need Chipotle seasoning. Who knows? I don't know. Making it up as they go. I picked up two cowgirl grillers. The other haul that I'd done maybe a week or two ago, I had done a cowboy and a cowgirl griller. And I really like the actual chicken breast um, where you can, I don't know, where it's just like an entire, it's just a thing of chicken. This is actually ground up and formed into a burger patty. So we picked up two of those and one just chicken. You know, it's just stuffed um, of those. And then we got a cheddar stuffed onion. And what's this? Oh, I got two of those? Okay, so I guess I got two grillers and two burgers and an onion. That's perfect, that's fine. I couldn't remember what I was ordering when I was there. But yeah, so there's like our meat stuff. And then we got an onion, some buttermilk, that's for a recipe that we're making. Uh, some green beans from the Aldi is what gave me the idea for the green beans to have like the almonds on them. So I had to pick up the green beans at Hy-Vee because they didn't have them at Aldi, which Aldi is like hit and miss. I swear if I want to do all my shopping at Aldi, there's always a handful of things that they don't have or they are not carrying that day or they're out of or whatever their story is. Um, and then I got some of these uh, pastas. They're just kind of fancy little pastas, but they were on sale cheaper than the cheap pasta. So they were like 88 cents a piece. I like that. 
Uh, some lentils. Bella loves lentils. So I picked up some more lentils. They last you forever. So like this bag, you don't even have to cook very much of them. Like they really do last. And this is good until next summer, August of 2020. So you can pick up like a cheap bag of lentils and they will last you a long time. I know. She eats weird things. I didn't do anything special to get her to eat anything strange. She, it's just the luck of the draw. Some kids hate vegetables and some like them. Um, I ended up getting the one that likes it. And that's good because, you know, it's good to like them and not have to like struggle. So I know that I'm lucky with that. Uh, and then we got some of these pita chips. I don't know for sure, but I have a feeling that the bags got smaller, but we're getting charged the same price. And the bags that I thought I was buying are like double the price. So this little dinky bag was three bucks. But I'm pretty sure I bought the bigger bags before for the same price. Anybody else notice that? Do you guys buy these ones? Anyway, that annoyed me. Um, and then I got a bunch of mushrooms. I didn't know Bella liked them. And so since we're having a lot of meat things, I thought we could just kind of split it up throughout the week and eat, you know, a handful of them with each of our meals. Also, I didn't know that this is how many you got in a pound. I had no idea. So when I ordered a pound and paid $7 for all of these, I think I typically bought like three to five at a time. And so getting... That, I don't know. That's like a lot of mushrooms. I've never in my life bought that many. And then, of course, just uh, some beer and olives. So, that is my haul this week. Thank you so much for watching, and we will see you in our next video. Bye. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button, hit that button, and comment. Bye. Bye.